Today, we're in the herd with men's water polo. The Bison are gearing up for their final event of the year, which is the Collegiate Water Polo Association Championship. The tournament, which features 12 teams, will be held on MIT's campus in Cambridge, Massachusetts. The field is very strong. Everyone's on equal footing. All, all the teams have been preparing very well for each other. So, you know, you got to beat all the best teams to win. So we start off with some of the best teams, and, you know, whether we play them in the first game or the last last game, it doesn't matter. we got to win all the way through, so we're excited. One of the standouts this year has been sophomore goalie Charlie Niehaus. He has started all but one game this year after logging only 48 minutes a year ago. Uh, definitely more by playing. Uh, I mean, it was easy to pick it up when I got a defense like I do supporting me. I mean, they make my job so easy, and it's been easy to adapt into the starting position. The Bison will be the seventh seed and take on the tenth seed, George Washington, on Friday at 11.20 a.m. Eastern Time. The Bison swept GW in the regular season, but the Orange and Blue know they have their work cut out for them after an uncharacteristic showing in the Southern Championships just two weeks ago. It always comes down to focus and concentration. Who can execute the fundamentals better? Who can execute their game plan and make the least amount of mistakes? Six on five is going to be crucial, as well as five man. So, um, you know, it just comes which team is better prepared when they show up on uh, Friday. Uh, yeah, I think a lot of people see us as the underdogs, and we've really embraced that mentality. Uh, we really have nothing to lose, so we're just going to go out there and do our best, and I think it's going to have some good results. The CWPA Championship runs Friday through Sunday. Continue to check BucknellBison.com for daily results.